Carlito Chalagura and Devaris Shock Roth. I'm not really going to read all of this. I'm just going to show you guys just in case you want to check it out. It's basically saying uh, what happened last time when Shelton Benjamin, you know, well, Ch Carlito and Chavo, they attacked Big Show and all of that crap. And me, I'm teaming up with them now. Well, if you guys didn't see last episode, well, I decided to choose to, you know, take sides with Ch Chavo and Carlito, which means I'm a heel, basically. I didn't decide to team up with Big Show. But I have some messages. What is this? Hey, man. I'm glad you came to your senses and decided to join us. That's very cool. I want to say good luck to you and Navari in tonight's handicap match against Big Show. There's two of you and only one of him, so you should have no trouble taking him down. Adios. Oh, wow. I guess he's right about that. Um... What the hell? Okay, I have no clue what he just said. He was speaking, I don't know what language he was speaking. <laughs> I read it while he was talking, but that was weird. I didn't see that coming. He was very full of energy there. He was, he was going all out. Um... Okay, that was weird. But anyway, I'm going to just go ahead and start this event. I'm not sure what's going to happen first. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a two out of... I think it's a two against one match. Yeah. Shelton and Devar versus Big Show. Now I got to make sure I win this match. If I lose this match, that's just crazy. Well, I'll tell you, King. I've been hearing rumors of Big Show's mood of late. And let me tell you... Right. Everything about the Big Show is scary when he's this angry. How many superstars would accept a two-on-one handicap match just to take out their frustrations on somebody? Not very many, King, but there aren't many superstars like the Big Show either. There's no question that he is a unique and dangerous individual. some respect for this superstar, but I'm sorry to say that my opinion of him has changed dramatically over the past few weeks. Like him or not, he knows the value of strength in numbers. When you've got the big show mad at you, you'd better find some friends and quick. Maybe so, but I wish he'd be a little more discriminating in his choice of friends. Is someone like Navari the kind of company you really want to keep? Oh man, the star crunches. Oh man. Sweet tooth here. Um, anyway. Okay, sorry if you guys hear me eating. I was eating some star crunch. But anyway. Uh, as you can see, I'm now a hill. And the crowd is, they booed the living heck out of me as soon as I arrived in the arena. I was actually surprised by that. They was booing me out of the building. And I gotta be careful here because Big Show beat me last time when we was in the same ring together. And mmm. Mm, got him with that punch. And we'll show up to end this early. Whoa, wow. Two already? Man, shocker, man, shocker. And oh, I thought I had him with that kick. Shelton and uh, Devar, that's a pretty odd team in my opinion. <laughs> you can't really picture these guys uh, teaming up in real life. That'd be probably the most oddest team of, of all time. And oh man, he just pushed me out of nowhere. And Devari, he used to be with this guy named Muhammad Hassan or something like that. He used to have that theme song. He actually came out with that theme song, yeah. Oh no, are you serious? He he actually caught me right there and oh he got me. Okay, I need to start reversing him. I'm kinda rusty right now. And I'm yellow already. Are you serious? Wow. And he's reversing that little kick out, that little dragon kick or whatever it's called. And, oh, he, oh, okay, I, I got to get out the ring. Okay, there we go. Nice. 
I'm gonna play some heal, some heal moves in this in this match. Hopefully, okay. I want to hit a diving attack if I can. Uh, what is Davari doing? And got him. What was that? I glided in the air. Wow. <laughs> Man, that, that that motion though when I jumped off that rope. And Davari, get him, Davari. Whoop his ass. And by gosh, Davari is beating up the Big Show. The impossible. Okay, I should jump right now and got him. Barely. Looks like I hurt most of my uh I hurt most of my body instead of his and mm, And got him with that kick. I mean Navarre gonna jump the living heck out of Big Show. Can I attack the ref? I really wanna. And got him, okay. Looks like I'm finna get a chair. Okay, hopefully the ref won't get up now. Is he up? Is he up? And he is down. Come on, get your ass up, bitch. And Navarre, come on, F off, man. Come on, you see me with a chair in my hand. And got him. Mmm. Okay, is the ref up? Oh, crap, he's getting up. And Davari is demolishing him. Oh, my goodness. Well, I guess I'll just sit here. Man, this game compared to SmackDown vs. Raw 6, the pace is very, like, it's way slower than before. Um, oh, 6, it had, like, it had kind of, like, a fast gameplay type of style, but, man, if I ever, like, get a chance to do SmackDown vs. Raw 2008, that's gonna be even slower. <laughs> I promise it is. Like, that gameplay was so slow. And, um, oh, crap, I got the chair. I shouldn't use that. <laughs> I wanna get myself disqualified here. And, wow, you never see Big Show hit that. I don't want to go for an early T-bone. Okay, I'm trying to store this. There we go. Mm. How do you tag? Uh, there we go. Okay, I guess I got to stand on this rope. And watch these two fight. Okay. Oh, my God. Referee, shut up. I would get in this ring and just attack him, but I'm not going to do that. And what is Big Show doing with Davari? He's just walking around the ring and... Man, he just gave him a rolling fireman carry. <laughs> what is he looking at? Son? And I just mm, got him. That move was called the Dragon Slayer, the, or the Dragon Kick, or something like that. Really not sure what it was called, but it was. It was. I know it had like the word dragon in it. So nice. There is no way Devar is gonna be Big Show by himself, man. Look, the guy is already yellow. Oh my goodness. I think Bishop gave him like a few attacks and Davari attacked Bishop more than uh, he did. Mm. Mm, nice. Now he's yellow. Well, he's orange. His head is orange. I want to make him critical in this match after what happened last time. And tag me in Davari. And oh man, he gave him that knee to his face. Man, I really wish I was able to to use music again, man. It doesn't feel the same, like, you know, without music. Because last game, uh, I had music in every match that was in the game. But this game has music that's kind of on and stuff. So I can't really do nothing with that. And, okay, that was pretty good what I just did. I just broke up that pin. <laughs> okay, tag me in now. Nice. Okay, come on. Mm, mm, mm. And just got him with that combo. That was perfect. Mmm. Yeah, yeah, get, get him, Navari. Get him, Navari. Double team, let's do it. Oh, what? Man, you must be high, Navari. There is no way you can pick up Big Show. Oh, no. Are you... Oh, no. Are you serious, bro? Wow. Man, a crowd in this game looks so... And this is the, this is that TNA crowd, dude. Oh my gosh! Like no one is. I don't know if it's just because of, it's it's PSP or something. I, I don't know what it's like on PS2 because I haven't played this game on PS2 in forever. But the crowd on PSP in this game look horrible. I mean, just look at them, man. They look like flat figures, man. Horrible. How can you do I, I could have sworn you could grab, then you could. Dude, he is getting demolished. And T-Bone suplex, and I got him. That got to be it right there. And got him. What? Wow. 
For a sec, I thought he was critical, but he's on he's on orange right now. I can't believe this man actually kicked out of that. Wow. Like my dandruff all on you, and he is knocked out. Wow. I'm not sure how you eyes ripping this game. I need to find out pretty soon. That's what I need to do. And I am now on critical after that throw. And oh, right in my back. And that referee is uh he's he's very strict on the VAR. I don't know why. I guess he's like the heck the referee might be racist or something. I don't know. <laughs> he was looking dead at the VAR with that look. The referees look pretty weird in this game. But a referee, because it's it's only one. I think that's Earl Hebner. Or someone else. Mm, mm, mm. Oh! Give me that Ric Flair chop. I want to eat my Star Crunch, but I'm pretty sure uh, I'm going to get attacked. And what is this? That was the most ugliest fall away slam I've ever seen, but he got me with that. Like in, in the current games of the fall away slam, it, it goes way farther than that. That's that JBL follow away slam, and I got him with this T. Are you serious? Wow. Oh my gosh, he just big boot the life out of me. I think it's best if I tag in the VAR right now. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay. Run. Oh, you si Oh, wow. Come on, get up, Shelton. And run. Okay. Come on, run, run, run. There we go. Come on, come on. Hurry and tag him. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Big Show's about to squash me. Oh, oh, my goodness. Come on. Okay. Yes. And Big Show, I think he's finna get, I think he's getting ready to choke slam Davari. And Davari tried slapping his chest. That didn't do no damage. That's one thing I like about this game. They actually have that little weight detection thing. Like, in... WWE 2K14, the weight detection is just horrible. Like, you still could pick them up and do unrealistic things, like the most unrealistic reversal. If you reverse a Big Show move, you can reverse into a belly to belly with Rey Mysterio, and that's, oh crap, hold up. I'm running my head, I'm finna, and got him with that German suplex. I did the impossible. Now, that right there is what you would not see in real life. Come on, Davari, get up. You know, as a matter of fact, just tag me in. I need to get on this rope. If he uh, gets up, I'll be able to get in that ring, T-bone him, and end this match. Dude, he is out. Oh, my gosh. Okay, come on. There we go. And got him. T-bone suplex. Are you? Oh, freaking roll break. That's, oh, man. Oh, he, oh wow. I thought I had him with my uh, back attack, and he gave me a shoulder block. By gosh, I just stung him in his eye. That is illegal. Just that is something illegal. And German suplex just got him. Now the T-bone. I might just pin him off for this. I should have just hit my finisher and roll break, of course. But you know what? Oh my! It's so hard to hit a finisher when it's on when it's on legend, though. Oh my gosh! They reverse like everything. Oh no. I need to get my stamina up, dude, because I'm about to fall down pretty soon. There we go. Nice. Around this time, Big Show was that ECW Big Show. He was, like, this game came out, like, in 2006. Yeah. He was that ECW Big Show at that time. And, um, like, right around that time, ECW just came back. He was resurrected. And I remember he had this rivalry with Sabu. They had a pretty good rivalry, actually. And uh, Sabu used to get demolished by the Big Show. Oh, my gosh. But I remember one time on an ECW episode, Sabu had that ring bell. He hit Big Show in the head, and Big Show just flew out the ring. And, oh, my gosh, I reversed that. <laughs> but anyways, uh, Big Show flew out the ring, and uh, he went through a table, and he was busted open. That was insane. Come on. Come on. He keep eyes ripping me back and forth. And what is he trying to do here? Oh, my Ah, oh, my neck. Ah, oh. look at the referee, dude. The referee is looking into space, complaining. Come on. I thought the referee in this game like take the chair out, but I guess he's not doing it. Wait, is, is DQ on? Or off? That's good. Hold up. Okay, it's on, of course. 
And now if it was off, this match would have been over with because I can get extreme. And man, that has to hurt, man. That's 500 pounds walking to your back. Oh, man. Oh, now my ribs are hurting. And you ain't hitting that big boot, son. You getting this kick. And I just got that perfect. That might be it. I'm pinning off of that. That might just be it. That might just be it. And got him. Just beat him off that kick. What the hell is the Bari doing? And he did. Okay, that looked weird. By God. Oh my, that has to hurt. Man, Big Show can take out the whole posse. <laughs> what do you mean, uh, King? Wow. I don't know about Shelton, man, because Shelton, I just kicked him in the face. He actually lost to a kick. That's just embarrassing. But, um... I might have any. I might have some messages. I, th I think I have to begin my week before you know everything get anything gets updated. So I think that's what I have to do in order to see something new. And I, yep, I'm gonna try that. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna begin my week this time again, and hopefully everything will update. I'm trying to get used to this game. I'm trying to see like if you. If you begin your week, everything instantly updates, like you get new messages, and yep, I was right. Okay, let's see. What do I have on my phone? Messages. Hey, it's Carlito. Oh, okay, sorry about that, guys. I thought he was actually uh, going to talk, but he... Wait, hold on a sec. Okay, yeah, there's no voice icon. Hey, it's Carlito. What the hell was that last week? How could you stand by and watch Big Show destroy the void like that? What part of strength and numbers don't you understand? I guess if I want something done right, I've got to do it myself. So that's why I'm, I'm challenging Big Show to a match tonight. Yes, that's right, me. Carlito against the Big Show. I would travel in you as my partner, so get ready and try not to screw it up this time. Oh, what the hell? He's blaming me for the Vari's accident, man. I kicked Big Show face off. Hell, I wouldn't mind kicking Carlito's face off. <laughs> He's blaming me for the loss? Wow. Carlito is such a douchebag. <laughs> what he's going to do? Get an apple and spit it in Big Show's face? And whoa, the bar is injured. Oh, that's nice. They actually have a thing with it. It lets you know if a superstar is injured. Uh, Raw superstar Devar has suffered serious injuries and would not be medically cleared to perform for at least two to three weeks. Wow. Well, he out. He gonna be out for a good while. But um, looks like we. I still have this feud with Big Show going on. I don't know when it. Well, I have no clue when this feud is gonna end. But uh, I may have another match against him. Well, Carlito said he's facing Big Show. I keep. Ah, I'm so stupid right now. I keep forgetting what I was. I just got finished reading. I just got finished reading what Carlito said he was gonna do, which was attack the Big Show, and I'm supposed to be managing him. Well, both of these guys travel in Carlito. So this is a one-on-three handicap match, basically. I thought I was being the manager, but I guess all three of us are really facing him. But uh, let's do this. I, spit in the face. I was talking to Carlito backstage, and he said that if he wanted something done right, he'd have to do it himself. That's why he challenged the Big Show to a match here tonight. Imagine that, challenging the Big Show. Now that's cool. Yeah, to a handicap match with Chavo Guerrero and that no good turncoat as his partners, a three-on-one -on match? That sure takes some guts. Carlito's quite a man. And I spit in the face of people who don't want to be cool. Ooh, Chavo. From El Paso, Texas, weighing 200 pounds, 
Chavo Guerrero. Ain't no stopping me, no. From Orangeburg, South Carolina, weighing in at 245 pounds, Shelton Benjamin. Show's got his work cut out for him, King. He's facing three dangerous opponents here tonight. Now, wait a second. I know this is a handicap match, but I'm sure Carlito's planning on keeping the Big Show all to himself. He just wanted his friends to have the best seats in the house. Give me a break, King. If Carlito sets one foot inside the squared circle tonight once the bell rings, I'll eat my damn hat. He's a no-good coward, and you seem to be the only one who can't see that. Oh, man, that was hilarious what uh, JR just said. <laughs> he said it, he'll eat his darn hat. That's hilarious. Uh, but anyway, okay, this is basically a three-on-one match. So it uh, looks like an, oh, wow, I might just stand here. No, I do want to get some damage in. But um, anyway, uh, man, JR had, like, the best commentary ever, man. I really wish he was still commentating nowadays, but he got fired for some odd reason. And what is Carlita doing here? What is this? And... Oh, nice elbow. It looked like he missed it. <laughs> He's gonna jump the bitch. This is the shield. The shield of two... Hell no. Can't compare these guys to the shield. And by God, what a German suplex. That unrealistic German suplex. <laughs> that was a bad timing, what I just did. I jumped so wrong. And, uh, man, I, I'm afraid if I hit Big Show, I might end up hitting one of my partners. So, Cause these guys will get in my way if they wanted to. And I'm going to just go ahead and taunt, wipe the dandruff on his face. And, yeah, I'm the man. I'm the man. He got the Brock Lesnar taunt. And, then, wow, Big Show's yellow already. Wow, shocker. I'm going to give him that kick again like I did last match and defeated him with it. And, oh, look at that. See, I hit Carlito on accident. And what is Chavo thinking trying to pick up Big Show? Oh, and just got him. I actually thought he reversed that for a sec. Mm, mm. Then he just punched. Dude, he just punched both of us down. Wow. He gave us like one, one little swing and both of us just fell to the mat. That's insane right there. Okay, now hopefully Big Show's going to get out of this animation. And then I can jump like right about now. And got him. Fail. Epic fail. I thought I was doing a little cross body he does, but he did the wrong move. I promise, man, that clothesline in this game, that diving clothesline is such an overseller. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. He's dragging Big Show all over the ring like he's a dog. And break this up, son. Heck no. Anything can happen, man. Big Show, uh, he might not even kick out of that. Mm. I want to hit my finisher. Well, Big Show, of course, is kicking out. He's only on yellow. And what is Carlito doing? Come on, are you see? Okay, that, okay. See, look at that. Chavo's in my way. I was trying to hit Carlito. Okay, I'm going I'm to forget about these guys. I'm going to just focus on the Big Show. But these guys are just getting in my way. And, man, Big Show's getting hurt pretty quick than usual. Because, like, if you face him in a one-on-one, -on -one, it takes a while to actually hurt him for some odd reason. And elbow dropping, of course, Carlito. Needs to F off. There we go, double clothesline, nice. Now I'm doing something, finally. And by gosh, Shelton Benjamin is working on that arm. And all oh, knees to that arm, a big show. Mmm. Yeah, big show, it's time to get jumped. You in, you in the, the posse, man. This is the posse, this is... Well, these guys don't have a tag team name, actually. It's just called Carlito's Posse. So I'm going to just call these guys the Posse, I guess. You're in the way of the Posse, Big Show. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wipe my danger fall on your face while you getting submitted. Yeah. And yeah, I'm the man. I'm the man. 
Okay. The Big Show's getting his ass kicked. I need to... He's, he, he's getting his ass handed to him. Okay, he's gonna... He's not getting up yet. My partner keeps trying to get him. Break this up. I want to hit my finish on him. Come on, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. I'll reverse it. Come on. Perfect time for a T-bone. And got him. Oh, he reversed my finisher too? Are you serious? Wow. Oh, no. Big Show's mad. Oh, no. He's trying to take out everybody now. He just reversed uh, Chavo's finisher. Then he just reversed mine like as soon as I try hitting mine. I got to get my resilience. Well, no, no, no. Mine's full. Mine's is full. And got him. Wait, what? I thought I hit him. Wow. Mmm. 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 Get off me, son. Oh, I should have hit my T-bone while I had it. And what is you doing, Chavo? I would have kicked him in the stomach if you didn't hit my legs. Come on. Okay. Oh, my God. Idiotic partner, man. Idiotic partner. Well, I guess this is it. And Big Show got demolished. I, I'm like, I'm like, hands down, man. I didn't do anything in that match. They took over that whole match. I didn't do literally nothing. They just demolished him. It was basically a two-on-one. And by gosh. Oh, man. What is this? Double choke slam. By gosh, he just gave him a double choke slam. I don't think he wants any part of the big show, King. I wouldn't blame him. Hey, where you going? Don't Home. You just got? No. Oh my, oh my gosh. Well, I'll tell you what. You're gonna get some next week on Raw. And just to make sure that nobody interferes. What do you say you and me make it a cage match? Oh no. I'm not sure he's got much to say the matter, King. This is the kind of match the Raw fans dream of. Oh my. Are, are you serious? I have a cage match against the Big Show coming up. Oh man, are you serious? Well, that match is going to be pretty good, most likely. Um, And I have a message. Wow. Let's see. What do we have here? And Jonathan Coachman, talent scout extraordinaire. Shelton Benjamin, executive assistant to Mr. McMahon, Jonathan Coachman here. I have, I'll have to keep this brief as I've currently got a lot on my plate right now, being personally groomed to be the next chairman of the board of the, hell no, nah, of the WWE and all. But enough about my unparalleled job performance. It's come to my attention that you've earned three victories. All you have to do now is get one more for a title shot. Now, as I'm, as not, I'm botching my, can, uh, I can't read for shit sometimes. <laughs> I keep talking too fast. I have to slow down. Now, as I'm sure you know, I'm no stranger to entering competition myself. So my advice to you is stay focused and try not to concentrate. Forget it. Ah, forget it. Forget it. So basically, he's saying that um, I've won three matches so far and I have enough. Well, if I get one more victory, I'll be able to get a, a title shot. I don't know at what title, but maybe the world title. Who knows? Or the WWE Championship. But um, anything can happen, guys. But uh, thank you all for watching this video. Please leave me, please give me a like and subscribe to my channel. And leave your thoughts below and comment below. And um, again, please subscribe. Stay tuned for episode three. And peace. Time heavy grind, get in mind till I reach the finish line. Never die, tell you why I stay prepared.